Yasu, you have a really great question about word order in Greek. Um, the critical thing to notice here is that to, which comes before the verb, as you noticed, is a pronoun, not a complete noun phrase. So to after pinito is a uh, complete noun phrase. They are both direct objects. So um, in the case context in which you're describing, they probably both be direct objects. Um, so if you wanted to say like, I want the car, um, you would say, Thelo, to quinto. And if you want to say, I want it, it would be to Thelo. Now, um, that's the reason why. The, the to is a pronoun. And so pronouns come before the verb and complete nouns come after the verb. And interestingly, um, to me anyway, English is probably unusual in that we put both pronoun and the direct I'm, I'm sorry, the pronoun and the complete noun phrase after the verbs. So we say, I want it and I want the car. But Greek is similar to languages such as um, French and Spanish, which also would put that um, pronoun, the direct object pronoun, before the verb and the complete noun phrase after the verb. So um, Greek's not really strange in that way, I would say. Thank you.